go see the Grand Canyon from the bottom experience, the river experience, the cliffs, the colors, the layers. There's so much to see and to take in. It has been fantastic. Because this is something very unique. You come as strangers and you leave as friends. This place is just unbelievable. It's a chance to recharge the batteries. What a wonderful uh, escape for a few days. There's nothing like investing in your family, and this is an investment. It's just building such good memories. Disconnect from the world so you can reconnect with your family. It's one of those things that you'll never forget. I genuinely think it's the best trip I've ever been on. Uh, there's just nothing better than seeing the Grand Canyon from the river. I've seen the canyon from all different angles and it's special in every way, but there's nothing like a Grand Canyon river trip. When you do the three-day river trip with Western River Expeditions, you uh, start off in Las Vegas and fly into the Bartend Ranch. At the Bartend Ranch, uh, you'll get put on a helicopter and then you have this amazing experience of being able to fly into the Grand Canyon and land on a beach down at the bottom of the canyon. The scenery from the get-go is amazing, and it just gets better as the trip continues. To see the Grand Canyon from river level is really a unique experience that most people who've ever visited Grand Canyon will never get to enjoy. The three and four day Grand Canyon expeditions are a great way for maybe someone who doesn't have a whole week of vacation or is trying to incorporate the Grand Canyon experience into part of a greater trip. It's a great uh, experience for children and families to go on. And that second day on the three-day trip is really full of a lot of action and a lot of excitement. The scenery is amazing and it's really one of the best days that, that Western has on any single trip. We will have a, a series of rapids that we start into, starting off usually with 205 rapid or 209 rapid, and then continue on down with about 10 major rapids that we run during that day. After our lunch on the second day, on the three-day trip, we usually go to a place called Travertine Grotto. Travertine Grotto, it's one of the more adventurous waterfalls that we take people to because we actually string a rope ladder up and give people the option whether to just sit in the pools down below the waterfall and enjoy the shade down there, or whether they want to actually climb up these rope ladders with us and we'll help them along the way into a hanging grotto above that is probably the most picturesque little waterfall grotto that we visit in the entire Grand Canyon. The last morning of the three-day expedition, we have a big breakfast and then we will load up the boats and get ready for our final run out. Uh, we'll be running out through beautiful canyon for a couple hours and then after, after a couple hours we will encounter the jet boats. The jet boat will pull up alongside us. We will load all of our bags onto the boat at Lake Mead. You load up on a bus and take about a two hour drive back to Las Vegas. I have seen this uh, many times over the years. People who have done a three day expedition with us in the Grand Canyon have enjoyed their trip so much that they'll come back and actually do the upper trip, the six or the seven day expedition with us. They enter that small elite club of people who have seen the Grand Canyon from top to bottom. If you want to see the Grand Canyon, this is the way to do it.